We're out here trying to uh, metal detect for enough money to buy lunch. That's our goal today. And, and that used to be a common thing. Like years ago, there was a branch of metal detecting where people used to uh, just look for modern coins, right? And so, some people reported finding like, you know, over a thousand dollars a year in coins plus some, some gold jewelry. So, uh, but those days are coming to a close. That's gotta be a quarter, you think? Did you find it? All right, let's keep going. We were wrong. What is it? Quarter. Yeah. The machine said it was a dime. Hmm. Maybe there's another dime down there. Let's try. 86. Hmm. That's gotta be another quarter. 27, 28, 79. No. No. What's 76 plus 25? Got it. What is it? It looks like there's a quarter here, there, 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 all the way out into the field because the concession stand is over there. So kids come running through that gate, they hit this open field, and they start rough and tumbling and running wild, and there's change everywhere here. So we're in a good spot. I think it's another quarter. Can you read the date? What does it say? 1788 on the back with the Statue of Liberty. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a bird band. Like that was on a bird's leg. What is it? Quarter. How many quarters do you think that is so far? Hmm, it'd be like five. That's a loud signal now. Very loud. What does it have? An eagle on the back. Okay. We just found another quarter. That's nine quarters and two pennies. Sounds like a quarter, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. My help has gone home now, and I have that much time to see if I can find enough money for lunch. Five, six, seven dollars. That's my goal. So I'm just gonna keep hunting, maybe into the into the dusk. Keep hunting until the police show up. So, okay. I can't believe the amount of quarters that there are to find. It's gotta be the, uh, the way that the stuff is priced in the concession stand. how fast I'm going. It's like this. If I was hunting a farm, I would never do that. My, my pinpointing is terrible. <laughs> my plugs are no good. I'm trying my best, but... This is just not what I do. How time flies, you know? Like, I remember when these quarters first came out. I didn't like them at all, this like new design. And now, these quarters are eight inches deep. Like, that's crazy. I mean, time goes by so fast. They grew up so fast and things that were 
like worth something or now it's just junk like like this right here that's all just zinc junk it's hardly worth anything so so what do you do the best I can tell uh, you search for value in other places and other things uh, I got three dollars and I have that much time left I need at least five <laughs> to buy lunch so it doesn't help that these quarters are worth less than ever before so okay let's go look at this it's another quarter <laughs> it looks much much brighter in this viewfinder than it does out here the camera is artificially adding some light so but it's getting dark that one's in good shape pretty good shape this is so easy compared to what I normally do. Like I can literally notch out dimes and, and pennies and just go for the quarters. I just found another quarter. I'm going to leave this field for somebody else. I'm just no good at this. My, my plugs are no good. My pinpointing is no good. Where, where I'm used to hunting, like out there in the woods, in the field, in the swamp, you can't pinpoint. <laughs> you just can't because there's so much iron in the ground. Uh, yeah, so this is not my natural habitat. It's fun. That's nice. I just found two quarters. <laughs> Back in the days of survival, everyone had a job to do that would benefit everyone else. You know, I mean, some people were good at hunting, some people were good at fishing, some people were good at growing things, some could forage. And then you had these people that could, you know, find the right minerals or find metal ores or precious metals. And so this is where metal detecting came from. And these, these talents were so advantageous to the health of the clan that I'm guessing the brain circuitry behind these talents was preserved in, in genes. And to this day, some people still have some of these genes. And so you see people fishing when you could just buy fish from the store, you know. And, and that's what metal detecting is. It's not, it's not finding coins. I mean, it's, it's just expressing the desire to find things, you know, that would be helpful, you know. And, and if you have some of these genes and you express this, then you are essentially expressing who you are on a, on a fundamental level, you know, and that is mental health.